getting it. Sorry, Kevin yeah, Coon, there'll be no delicious pancakes for you today. <laughs> anyway, welcome to the amazing spot fest. This time I'm actually not alone. What is up, guys? Johnny here. Yeah, it's been a while since um, he's made an appearance on my channel, but thank you for joining us here today. Oh, you're welcome. Are you more than pancakes or waffles? Head over to the spot fest terminal and pick a side. One step ahead of your game. Alright, what do we got? Marina, Marina, the statue's eyes glow at night. I swear, I saw them glow. Pretty sure that's his Judd's and little Judd's eyes. Yeah. Man, there's something magical about the camp, about campground at night. Fire glowing, crickets chirping, faces platting. <laughs> because, of course. I. <laughs> There's Pearl being so full of herself. Boss summons are afraid of me because they, they don't even try to attack me. Either that or you're so sure they mistake you for a chum. <laughs> I don't know why, I just love that. And, and sure enough, I catch you coon with his delicious pancakes. If you haven't played Persona 5, well, I highly, I highly recommend you do so. It's an, it's an amazing RPG. Alright, I'll, right, I'll start a game and you try to join me. Oh, did you create a room? And yeah, as you can tell, I've already played this game. Oh! oh. <laughs> also, how fitting that I made that Persona 5 joke. You got someone named Futaba. Oh, you didn't create the room. You just have to go scrap fest normal, and then press friends, and then create a room. That's all way I can join. I didn't see create a room. Just start or... Join friends. Uh, well, don't go to friends one. Go go to spot as normal, press friends, and then create a room. Then, uh, then I join you. <laughs> yeah, I haven't done this in a while, but oh well. Alright. After this, after this match, I'll do that. Alright. Well, it's a bare bones basic camp trigger fish, so. Because I do like the specific stage for this. I do uh, like the specific stage, stage this time around. Wait, are you on Sheep Station? No, I'm on Camp Triggerfish. Ah, I hate that stage. And I kinda like the I kinda, I kinda like the idea in this concept. Or the gates kinda come down and when there's a minute left in the match. That's one thing's good, but I just don't like the rest of it. Yeah, especially since in the original game, it was Sniper City. At least that's how I, at least that's how I remember it anyway. Yeah. I don't know. I kind of prefer the original variant as the, um, Mink Rails weren't exactly a thing. Kind of defeating the whole point of the, um, gates in the first place. I still like this map well enough. I, oh, I see you up there. Oh. Kinda got me there, I guess. You got me there about that. Okay, gates are down. Moving over here. 
Man, we are really losing this one. Excuse me, buddy. Holy hell. I'm having trouble keeping up with this guy. At least, the, at least during the pursuit, I was able to somewhat turn things around. So that's always a plus. Okay, I don't know how I might just score that kill, but I'll take it. Nice target, your tinted missiles. Of course, look at my piece about the tinted missiles and how I don't care for them all that much. Yeah, you've kind of gotten to see that there. That was a bad start. <clears throat> um, for those watching, if, if, in case he, in case you want to know why there wasn't some kind of um, I'm, I'm, I'm always forgetting okay, the word. So are you gonna, so are you gonna create the room? Yeah, I'm I'm great in the room. Okay. There you go. Now I can join. Perfect. Disclaimer. There's who why I pick certain teams. I only do that for the um, very important spot fest, like I did with um yeah, friends versus families. Yeah. Mm. <clears throat> oh, if you don't kick the bucket. <laughs> oh, Damn, trigger oh, fish. 10x battle. Whoa. 10k? Where were you already on? If you guys don't know, I need to. I need to cream. It's gonna be in my, on my, on my channel. Yeah. Because I played the entire spot this. Yeah, baby. Also, I kind of don't like this color of um, ink. I'm just saying it could be misconstrued as some. What color are you talking about? Our ink could be misconstrued as an in a appropriate substance, so I'll just leave it at that. What color are you talking about? Our ink. Uh, the one, like, orange? It's not orange, it's more beige. Oh. I actually like this color. Not me. It can be misconstrued as an inappropriate substance, so I'll just say that. Eh, I respect your opinion. It doesn't feel like pancakes to me, but this one, so, I mean, it doesn't feel like wobbles to me, it feels like a blueberry wobble. I guess I yeah, I guess your point actually. Yeah. Unlike the last spot fest where the um theme was kind of a kind of a joker from Batman. Yeah. I don't know I don't know why I thought it'd be safe. There, but nope. Yeah, baby. <laughs> Cocked it up to hubris. I don't know. Hi, buddy. How's it going? Mm -hmm. uh, I think you can use this this ink armor more than I can. Man. Oh, okay. That's a good catch, um, Demon. The way that that's spelled, it kind of more so reminds me of Super Paper Mario, you know, and it's um, parody of the Underworld. Yeah. 
Uh, D-Man as in Demon, J.U. as in Hades, Rubber Twigs being the Rubber Six. I will say, I will, I will say, it is actually a lot darker than you you would think a Mario game would be. <laughs> and even though it, it does have some RPG elements, but it, it's more of a platformer than anything. Hmm. All right, that was bad. And I didn't yeah. see someone behind me. Yeah, we definitely lost this one. And thank you for the warning. You're welcome. <laughs> that went horrifically. And before you ask, yeah, I definitely do plan on doing the auto expansion at some point. Nice. I'm taking weapons because that was bad. I've had that happen to me a few times. Yeah. What do you know? Pancakes versus pancakes. I have to think of that as um, pancakes versus the butter. <laughs> <laughs> that that never happened to me once I was recording. I never once got pancakes versus pancakes. I've gotten that off camera. Yeah. I recorded most of it off camera, but not once I got pancakes versus pancakes. <laughs> that's that's pretty funny. Yeah. Us and our bubble gum. We look like bubble gums from Margie Boo. Or Android 21. Remind me who Android 21 was? Yeah, from Dragon Ball Fighter Z. Oh, probably. Oh, the game. I got that. Yeah. Because Android 21 looks just like Margie Boo. <clears throat> It's a female. Android. Ah. If it's an Android, you can, pro you, you, you can probably assume it's built by Dr. Jero. Hi, buddy! You thought you were being clever, but you weren't. I gotta say, I actually kicked myself for, um... Ragging on the um, <clears throat> the sprinkler in the first game because it uh, it is it is especially helpful. Yeah. Not so much for getting kills, but making your special attack a, a little bit more affordable. Not only that, but making a good decoy. Yeah. I can't believe I ever ragged on that thing. <laughs> Here and okay, now that was being clever. That was being clever. Oh, that was on me. I was being a little too trigger happy. But I got you. But you know what? You know what? You know what? Fear the might of the Booyah! The Booyah ball was amazing. Right? That's the reason I'm always running that.
I thought we'd catch it up, but we lost the last second. That's usually how games worked in the original. It always came down came down to the last thirty seconds. Or fifteen seconds, as well. No, thirty. It happens to me in 15 seconds. 15 seconds, they catch up 15 seconds, and then I catch up with them back. Might be how it is in this game, but in the original, it's 30 seconds. Yeah. I mean, heck, last ditch effort. Well, guess what we're doing again? <laughs> yeah. Ay, 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 ay. Well, I am thankful you don't need a full set of four just to be able to play Splatfest with someone. Yeah. Mm. Right, what a Art Academy. I think this is what carried over from the uh, results from the um, one of the previous plot fests, you know, like art versus science. Yeah. Ah, one a five day for science. Beef jerky. I lost to art for the one for two one. Science is important, but. I kind of appreciate the arts. Okay. Booyah there. Yes, show me the one on, uh, 101 on game. One on one. <laughs> Be jerk! Be jerk! Jerky! <laughs> yeah, I just, I mentioned that earlier. Be jerky! Gamer 101 got me. I guess they didn't hear me when I mentioned the beef jerky. Yeah. Beef jerky got me. At least, uh, at least you didn't die to the lux luxurious jerky. Hmm. I don't care what anyone says. That's one of my favorite items in Earth Town. The luxur, the luxury jerky. Yeti. Well, one of my favorite items. Doug made me a fan of the, um, <clears throat> the calorie stick. I, I, got, I got a question. I get, I got a question for you. What? what can, you, can you imagine what a calorie stick would be? No. Now that can I. Just it's kind of one of those things that is really hard to imagine. And frankly, that's one of those things that doesn't sound very appetizing. I mean, a calorie stick. Last such effort with a booyah! Yeah. Okay, how did we do this time? It'd be amazing if that's what turned it around. Of course it didn't. Uh, okay. You got this one? Nope! Oh. By 2%! Oh my god! That was close! We nearly got it! That was close. And I got the most killed. If this were Call of Duty, that number would have been important. Yeah. But this isn't. I'm gaining weapons. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> 
Booyah Owls. <laughs> okay, so Tom you guys that was funny. I finished I <laughs> We finished the last match on a booyah bomb. We're gonna get booyah. <laughs> Sorry, that sounds kind of forced, but wow, that's funny. <laughs> Alright, you got a game? Ship D station, 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 smash for Oh, uh, you called it! You called yeah! it! Yeah! Wow. Okay, this ship station is pretty interesting. You see those zones that are scattered around the map? It's yeah. kind of um, splat zones from ranked. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie, I like the flutters idea a lot more than this. It's still an interesting idea and I like its concept. But just having a map with flutters I just like that idea so much better, especially with, you know, all the presents and stuff and all the candles that are on top of these flutters. And to have flutters on your side, mind you. That was the best idea Shifty Station has ever had. At least, to me. Well, uh, what was your favorite innovation of Shifty Station? It's kind of hard, because there's a lot. Some of them, it's least, it's my least serious station. But this one this year so far, I like the Spastone, when Spastone's a, a station. Yeah, that, that is a pretty cool idea. So that's the same time, <clears throat> Splat Zones, I like as a um, ranked mode. go. That's kind of, that, that's kind of why I picked the weapon that I did. The Bria Bomb in conjunction with the um, Slash Wall. Yeah. Make a pretty good combination. Well, at least I took down one of them. Yeah. I do kind of like the as that sprite shot of the, um, <clears throat> the tri Ah. Uh, Prime Net got me. Alright, Booya, Booya Owl, uh... Alright, there we go. Protect our zones! Whoa, it's my mom. This game is actually going pretty well. And you know what? To add insult to injury. Boo! Yeah! yeah. Yes, it is necessary for me to say it all dramatic like. Oh, uh, for one of my videos, I'm not sure if you caught it, but um, on the other, on the video where I was talking about. Uh, <clears throat> Um, dislikes being a um, meaningless number. I don't know if you caught it, but I said soldier instead of shoulder. I did that on purpose. So you just see how many people would catch it. Oh. Well, we finally won this one. <laughs> I got the most kills again. Oh, nice job with the courage. Thank you. Also, I'm glad they did away with that on an individual's little stats. I guess they kind of figured out how meaningless it was. <laughs> 